a practice a practice a prax skinoscope. I don't know how to say it. I don't I don't know what it's called. Prax skinis Practice. Practice. Yeah, there you go. Uh, it's a machine that was used before film. So they take a piece of paper with still images on it and they spin it around to try and create motion. I've worked in many, many educational establishments throughout my career and I think that what I'm learning is it's really important to stay abreast of technology. I also think it's, it's really important to retain the traditional skills of drawing and painting because I think they work hand in hand so I don't think one should replace the other and certainly for the Make Your Future project we've very much been looking at how art and science can come together. Our praxeoscope looks like it's from our hometown and it's all the popular things that, um, all the landmarks that are in Reddit. Our praxinoscope is actually um, turned via a Raspberry Pi. A Raspberry Pi is basically a little computer and like it uses a coding language that makes it program and so it can spin and it sets it every 10 minutes to spin for two minutes. We've used old record players to spin maquettes and paper models, testing different speeds and legibility of images at different speeds, exploring animation and illustration. And we've also explored lots of different metalwork techniques. This morning we were making um, different insects and bugs and leaves to go along the bottom. So yeah, we've been doing that, we've been texturing, dif te texturing different metals um, by hammering different patterns and um, indents into it and yeah, cutting it out and adding different things. The metalwork I've been doing is uh, wireframe and I've been, taking, I've been taking bits of metal wire and then using pliers to shape them into whatever form I'd like and then attaching them to itself to make a snail. Melanie has been an inspiration. I think that they have become much more confident. The quality of her direction and teaching and the resources that she's provided them with have been perfect because They've, they've had like a platform where it's, it was safe to do it. It's been fun working with Mel because like she helps you a lot and whenever you're stuck she'll always give you advice and she'd always like nudge you on. When I went to visit my um, future high school I was mainly looking at the photography because that's something I enjoy but now that I've done this it is one of my options in the future because I've really enjoyed it. We had no provision for metalwork. Um, I found some anvils. <laughs> so the benefit of gaining the equipment that we've had is like phenomenal. It's going to take our learning through the roof. Um, the art teacher's already planning on what she's going to use it for next year. Okay, so 